All right, this is a continuation. Turkey of Oat, the ethics of the fathers. Here we have, this is, we're right now on chapter four. And this is a continuation of what Ben Azai said. Here, let's see, Ben Azai. Ben Azai said. And what did Ben Azai say? Remember yesterday he said, even the most easy, simple, unexpensive commandments should be, <clears throat> uh, you should run after them. And even the apparent most insignificant sins you should avoid, run away from, because good things bring good and bad brings bad. Ben Azai continues and he says, don't altia baz the kaladam. Don't say that anyone is worthless. Altia maflig the kaladavar. And don't keep away. Maflig, he says, means keep away. We'll look and we'll see. Don't avoid things. In other words, something. don't say that there are people that aren't worth anything, and don't say that there are things that aren't worth anything. Why? Because every person has his day, his time, and everything has its place. And it's brought somewhere that King David had said that he, he looked at someone that was crazy on the street and said, God, would you make crazy people for this? is totally unnecessary. I mean, it's, it's just a big waste. What are you making crazy? And God said, oh, you think crazy people have no purpose? No. One day you're going to need that. And what happened was, is that King David, um, let me just move this over here. Oh. that King David somehow or other was, um, after he killed Goliath, 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 so somehow or other, he happened in the kingdom of Achish, who was Goliath's brother, and he wanted to kill King David. King David was, you know, his prisoner. He was going to kill him. And then King David, he started acting crazy. He acted like a madman. And Goliath's brother said, if I kill him, then that's it, he's finished. But if I let him live and he's crazy, he'll embarrass himself. Being insane is even better. It's a better revenge than being dead, but then killing him. So he let him live. So God said, see, I told you one day you were going to use this insanity for your own. And the same thing with every person. There's no person that doesn't have his time, and there's nothing that doesn't have a place. So we see that everything that God makes has a purpose, and maybe we don't know what it is, but don't say that there is no purpose whatsoever. And don't say that there's any person that has no value, no such thing. Every person is valuable. Every person is important. Right. Of Avadya Bartanuri says it a little bit differently, but okay, let, that's one explanation that I read. Have a good day with Mashiach now. Everyone is important.